Yeah. We're in there. That's why it's seats. Oh yeah, it has the That's savage. I'm not. We got it. Yeah. Not knowing me, I really want to. If I drop it. Signs look pink on my phone. I can save the live stream too. Phone is dying so fast though. Now this 
suites. They see out here in the end 16 people and 24 get towards the field. Every two only double the time. So they pick the suite in. This is by paying half. So a bank says it's a corporate. We're going to have four of them here. So we'll buy the additional tickets to bring them into the suite. If you're going to be invited to a game, hope that someone in the suite comes. Okay. If they pre order the food, it's a different menu than you get in the rest of the stadium. You have suite attendants to bring it to you. The drink is in here, this restroom is in here. So you really never have to leave the suite. So this one's a little bit smaller. So this particular suite runs about $100,000 a season. They started 90 on the end, up to nearly a half million dollars at midfield. down here and told to sit down. You're going to miss the game. To get a little more <coughs> zealous than that, Foxworth PD is going to put that handcuff on you and tell you to sit down. And if you really get out of hand, there's two cells in there and they'll put you, Foxworth PD will put you in there until they can take you down to the station. Oh, that's no fun. Uh, this is not, most of the time it's a place where people just get too excited, they need an hour or so and then they're good to go. But when the Jets are in town or when we have the Country Fest concert, we fill this and we fill another one just like it outside. <laughs> and the wagon runs all night long, back and forth. And we always tell folks, yep. if you can't find them, call Fox Road. <laughs> you can't, that's where they are. So this is what happens to the kids. And don't go over and put those cuffs on. We don't have those keys. That's, that's the police department has those keys. This is what they call a zero tolerance stadium. So if somebody acts up and they're a danger to themselves or someone else, anyway. fellow teachers and fans, <laughs> we'll escort them down here and ask them to have a seat. Now this area is no good. It's dark in here. Oh, it's a lounge. Oh yeah. They're out there. People were invited to stand outside on the patio because that visiting team, as I say, will come out the tunnel right there. And the women are friendly. They like to say hello and see how the family is, and how's your health, and things like that. We kind of all thought they'd go out there from the players come out for warm ups and then that'd be it. But people go out there and spend the entire game out there. They never leave. They stay out there. If you watch on TV, they'll show you down in the end zone. Easy come, easy go. Oh, I'm 